okay now the set of 30 questions and the topic covered is field effect transistor the field effect transistor is a transistor that use an electric field to control the electrical behavior of a device means FET is a voltage control device we have two type of FET one is uh, JFET junction field effect transistor and another is MOSFET metal oxide field effect transistor this is the uh, constructions of uh, JFET and uh, N channel P channel symbols for the JFET and this is the MOSFET N channel MOSFET enhancement uh, E MOSFET and D MOSFET this is the symbol for E MOSFET and this is the symbol for D MOSFET now the question one, number one is a JFET is a unipolar device a unipolar device is the device in which the current carrier are only electrons or holes they are only one type of current carrier the gate of a JFET is always reverse biased this is the biasing of the JFET for a N type JFET the gate this is the gate and that is the reverse bias for a P type gate there are this is also reverse bias the input impedance of a JFET is more than that of a ordinary transistor in a P channel JFET the charge carriers are holes when drain voltage equal to pinch of voltage then drain current remain constant with the increase in drain voltage okay first of all what is the pinch of voltage pinch of voltage is the drain to source voltage after which the drain to source current become almost constant as shown in the graph here vgs for vgs is equal to zero and the drain current is approximately constant then this voltage is called pinch of voltage at which IDSS is nearly constant at VGS equal to 0 hence the answer is remain constant the IDSS I, uh, drain current is constant number 6 if the reverse bias on the gate of a JFET is increased then width of the conducting channel is decreased this is the width of conducting channel as the reverse bias of the gate is increased this width is decreased because in reverse bias depletion width of the uh, gate is increased and hence the width of the conducting channel means this is decreased question number seven a MOSFET has three terminals or that are source drain and gate a MOSFET can be operated with positive as well as negative gate voltage means a MOSFET in a MOSFET gate voltage can be positive as well as negative when it is positive it work as D MOSFET and when it is negative it work as E MOSFET the input control parameter of a JFET is gate voltage means gate voltage control the input parameter of JFET or means J, uh, FET, FET field effect transistor is a voltage control device a JFET has high input impedance because input is reverse biased in a JFET when drain voltage is equal to pinch of voltage the depletion layer almost touches each other when there is the drain voltage equal to pinch of voltage then this gap becomes zero in a JFET IDSS is known as drain to source current with gate sorted the two important advantages of JFETs are high input impedance and scale law properly a MOSFET is sometimes called insulated gate 
because in a gas gate uh, in a mosfet the gate is insulated by metal oxide sio2 layer this red shown by sio2 metal oxide insulated layer or that's why this insulation we call mosfet as a insulated gate which of the following device has the highest input impedance that is a mosfet a mosfet metal oxide field effect transistor uses the electric field of a capacitor to control the channel current the gate and uh, uh, transistor uh, metal uh, as shown in the figure the, this is the gate and this is the channel the layer between the gate and channel work as a capacitor the gate voltage in a jfet at which drain current become zero is called pinch of voltage or that is the pinch of voltage here in a fet there are two p n junctions at the sides if the cross section area of the channel in n channel j fet is increased the drain current is increased because there is a more gap to pass the current as we increase the area of cross section of the channel and hence current increases the channel of a jfet is between the drain and the source when vgs equal to 0 vgs is the voltage between gate and source is zero the drain current become constant when vds exceeds vp pinch of voltage as vgs equal to 0 and vds greater than pinch of voltage the drain current become constant is certain j fet data sheet gives vgs of equal to minus 4 volt the pinch of voltage vp is plus 4 voltage here remember that vgs of is equal to negative of pinch of voltage pinch voltage or if vgs of is minus 4 volt then vp pinch of voltage is plus 4 volt the constant current region of a jfet lies between pinch of and breakdown region a mosfet differ from a jfet mainly because the jfet has a pn junction and mosfet has no junction at all a channel d mosfet with a positive vgs is operating in the enhancement mode and negative vgs is operating in depletion mode in a common source jfet amplifier the output voltage is 180 degree out of phase with the input field effect transistor is a voltage control device and this is the most important question and bjt by junction transistor is a current control device remember it a certain p channel e mosfet has vgs threshold is minus 2 volt if vgs vgs equal to 0 the drain current is simply 0 ampere because the threshold voltage is minus 2 volt the point where jfet is no longer be able to control the current is called breakdown region of the fet now the question for you according to the symbolic representation of n and p channel the gate arrow is always pointed toward p type material n type material p type in p channel fet and n type in 